My name is Second Lieutenant Karen Alderman. I'm the uh, adjutant for Marine Wing Support Squadron 273. The Marine Corps is pretty much the best service there is. I mean, you can't you know you can't really argue with that one. Um, and it's I feel like it's my part, and it's, you know everybody's got a responsibility, and this is the best way that I can fulfill that responsibility. Before I before I even checked in, um, I was told as a brand new Second Lieutenant I was going to have the uh, collateral duty of taking care of our squadron mascot, which is um, a wild pig, and. Uh, that was pretty. That was pretty interesting. I, I didn't. I didn't uh, anticipate taking on that duty when I came here. But I think pretty much what the Marine Corps teaches you, as far as perseverance and the leadership skills, um, they can. They're applicable to anything outside the Marine Corps. Um, you know, from an office job to you know being a parent to anything. So I don't know yet what I'm going to do, but I think it'll be. You know, whatever I do, the skills that I've learned here, I'll take with me. Performance after our aviational attrition with VMFA 332 out of Beaufort, South Carolina. Uh, what I do is I work on F-18s, uh, aviational attrition. We work on all the electrical systems on this jet, um, starting with light bulbs and going all the way through the navigation systems. We work on engine systems. Um, the shop that I work in, electric shop, uh, we deal with every aspect of the jet, obviously. What you do in this job is very important because it is someone's life. If, you, if you're not on your toes, and you don't take something to your best ability or buy the book, it has an effect. You could pretty much kill somebody. So it's a very challenging job. Um, keeping up with guys that, you know, I lift toolboxes that are almost half my size sometimes, and to keep up with the male, my male counterparts, it's challenging, but I, I love it. It gives me a sense of pride. And when I see that jet take off on that runway, and I'm like, wow, we did that. Me and, me and the guys that I work with, we did that. It's just great. We, we've uh, been in Iraq for seven months together. We've been through thick and thin, long hours, grumpy days, fun days, everything. And so we all know each other pretty well. You know, sometimes it's funny because we know each other better than our wives or husbands do. We're like, okay, you know, you're having a bad day. God can tell by this and that. And it's just funny to see how close you get, you know. And I wouldn't want to work with anybody else. <laughs>